Have you thought about launching your book to becoming a bestseller? I would love to know how to do that. <laughs> I, I, I think that a lot of us mature women, I'm saying that because I'm over 60 now. So a lot of us mature women, I kind of need to be reminded that we're still worth our self value is still worth something and that uh, not to give up hope. I mean, I have been divorced over 25 years. I still hope to remarry. And you have this book and I can see that you, you still have things that you want to do with this book. You, you, you might want to launch it to be a bestseller. You might want to have a masterclass based on like around the book. I would like to know what does creating this book and having this book, what has it meant for you? It has meant a lot of growth personally and spiritually. Um, and then it has uh, solidified my discipline lifestyle. So I, I think that's the biggest part of it. Um, you know, what we can keep in our heads and try to move forward and make happen. And, and when it doesn't work, we're frustrated. We, the women, we're more frustrated than him because he doesn't meet my standard. Well, baby, mm. the imaginary man can't meet your standards either. You know? so, yeah. Right. So let's not create barriers. So I just want to make yeah. sure that there uh, aren't any. Yeah. Yeah. That's great. So you're saying that the book has meant personal growth, mm -hmm. reflection. And I remember you saying that you basically use it as a business card at your at your events. Yes, I do. Um, mm -hmm. I had one guy ask me, is this a male mashing book? Um, and I was like, a male bashing book? I said, no, no, that's not what it is. It's not that at all. I'm not bashing men at all. <laughs> I love y'all. 